Kelp forests are globally important habitats found in cool temperate regions. They're comprised of a whole lot of different macroalgal species and usually dominated by a large canopy forming species. In a global sense they're in decline from a number of stresses driven mainly by things like temperature, um, sedimentation and also high nutrient runoff from the land and we're starting to hear that anecdotal evidence in New Zealand as well that our kelp forests are in slow decline. This project which is funded through an MB Smart Ideas grant allows us to take stock of, of the current situation in New Zealand in terms of the distribution and diversity of, of kelp forests and when I speak about kelp forests I'm specifically talking about Macrocystis or the giant kelp. We're going to be looking at the diversity of those different strains of Macrocystis across the New Zealand gradient and looking at the different physiological attributes that those strains have. So the idea is to select strains which show some sort of resilience to climate change, particularly increasing temperature, and use those strains which show resilience to reseed back into the wild environment. So this project will be driven, I guess, from a, a community-based restoration approach, and that means that it's restoring local areas driven by local communities who rely on those particular areas and we're really luckily, lucky to be supported um, through a long relationship with Naitahu and working with, within customary protection areas and a lot of this project will be driven through that, those relationships also.